Yo, what's up, guys? Three queuing, threes, twos, and ones. Whatever we get, we'll play. Let's get into it. See if we can get some dubs. Let's see how it goes. All right, but the first game we got Omar and Drew against myself and Scribbles. Scribbles? Scribbles? I'm not sure. The Z there. Oh, I got the boost. It's actually big. Messed up my flip cancel, though. That's what I wanted. But it's all good. My nose is so itchy. First time to have an itchy nose. Pass middle, good fake. Won't be one for a long time now. See what he does with it. Probably go to the ceiling here. Nice, well, that works. <laughs> I'll definitely take that. Use all my boost, went to the ceiling, touched to myself. Actually, good shot. Waited till the very last moment to shoot it. They ended up on goaling. It's too awkward on the goal line for too long. Played around one. Looking for the other guy. I'm going to fake jump here. Make a panic a bit. And I still have my full boost. Gotta fake him. I'm trying to jump too high on these, these attempts. So I don't waste too much boost. He does. Nice. Team had it covered. There's no point in me. Also, like full committing for it. Seemed like he had it down. You can just jump for him here. A little bit awkward. Got the boost as well and made him hit it away. I can just jump for this now. Why not? Almost a shot. It was a good attempt. Good turn here. As soon as he had that pinch, decided to cancel. Just stay on this. We got attempt. You may should have. Wasn't the best touch to the corner. Is there able to get an easy follow up like that? But it didn't turn out too bad. And he got a really bad first touch here, so he has no play on this ball. I don't really have to panic or anything. Played over one. Should just be a goal. Gonna just air dribble it in. Really good play there. Take our time with that. Spade him in, keep it close enough where we have the advantage the whole time, and then the very simple go after. They're playing really well. They're really good here. Try to get back left my teammate. He said need boost. Usually that means they want the back left pass. I'll kick off. I messed up here. I still saved it somehow. I don't I don't know how, to be honest. I missed the boost twice. So I played this back to myself. That was actually really good. I don't know. I don't know. I'm recovering out of like the weirdest situations. My teammate just got bumped. But I was last like for a while there. We recovered twice in swats. I should not have been able to get out of to be honest. Surprising myself a little bit this game. That's just unfortunate. And then they got two pretty bad goals to get it back. But that's two. So it happens. Bad kickoff and just their cheat was much more aggressive on it. So not a good kickoff for us because they got the ball, but just go aggro for it. Give me a shoot to shoot. Taking a slow approach, it works too. Good job. I think he had a, I think he had a goal against the shot, but it works. Maybe he didn't trust he can get the perfect shot in time. Dribbles are doing good though. Gives me a lot of space to have a shot there. I think the best bet, if you have space on a shot, aim low and as fast as possible. So you can just pick the spot they're not in and you hit it as fast as possible. They're not going to be able to save it. That's what I like to do on empty nets. Or like, not empty nets, but a shot where it's uncontested and they're just in net trying to defend it. It's low and fast. Always the uh, best thing to do, I think. Pick three pads on the way back here. I'm going to go for the, mid boot, the back boost and then just wait for a shot. It's not going to be that good. The shot very rarely is perfect. I think it's something that a lot of people have to understand, especially the lower ranks. They'll almost never be perfect. Even the high rank, though, the shot being absolutely perfect is very, very, very unlikely, from what I've noticed. So you can just play patient. A lot of times, you get a free ball off of it. Like, even there. Look, look at these situations. A teammate were just in two spots where 
they had a free shot technically and both of the shots were were not threatening at all you just could wait on the ground and it went over I'm not gonna go here there's no point it's going for a bump on me and you just threw the ball away again just free ball didn't even have to do anything for it i could just fake him here try to snipe it bottom corner there we go perfect it's a really smart play and there we go got it early forfeit that's really well played the whole game it's a little minor hiccup middle of the game they got two goals back like one little bump from them and then they got a kickoff goal they got two goals back off that and that's like twos can change really quickly in that aspect but yeah good game regardless a lot of good plays going on let's get into the next one see if we can keep it up and get back to back those let's see how it goes playing all three modes by the way Ooh, all right this is actually gonna be a good game we got spider in a ones game for the last match i did say i wanted to do a ones game for you guys so this would be good it's been a while since i played one of these he's a very solid player so we'll see not sure what to expect here. He's gonna go for this probably. If I had to beat him, it's not gonna be in, but still a good play. Good patience from him. Spider was an ex pro. Used to be on uh, what is now Oxygen. So he's a good player. It's gonna be a, a sweaty game for sure. A lot of ones, in my opinion, is just defending well. When they have their opportunities so that they get stuck in your net and also when you have your opportunity not over committing and that's the big thing about ones you have to try to master those two things always works a little fake i just did always works i went quiet for a second because i was focused but if you pretend like you're gonna go for the boost like here instead of hit the wall pretend like you're gonna go for the boost he has to respect the fact that i'm close to that ball the whole time he's not gonna dive in on that so i know i have the advantage there even though it looks like a sketchy situation Nice. Really good start. Three goals is nothing though in this mode. I got three goals in 40 seconds, so you can do the exact same back to me. Kickoff is looking good there right now. I'm gonna fake this one. I'm gonna go ground. Really good. Hopefully it's not in. Really good save from him though. Yeah, bad bounce for me. Unlucky honestly. There's a there's a pretty high chance that rolls up and I'm safe, but bounced up for him. Good save there from him. Maybe it would have been better play to just hit it to the other corner boost. Play the possession and then go for a shot when I have a, a better chance to. Kind of what I'm doing here. Play it to the mid boost. I know he has full boost here, so I'm going to get a flip early. Try to threaten the fact that I have this flip. I still have 40 boost, but I'm going to go for his corner. Oh, if I won the back boost, it would have been huge. I still have the goal, though. But, really good play to stay on that. Be annoying. Still got it. Looks like we still got it in ones, at least. I haven't played this one in so long. I think I have three placements done this whole season. <clears throat> I'm still playing how I want to play in this mode, which is good. Play to the corner to myself. Gonna fake him. He's gonna have a touch here. Oh, he got the boost. Huge win from him. I should stay on the ball again, maybe. Really good job. Cut down the space well. Honestly, been a little bit awkward. <laughs> Last little bit here, but good fake challenge to get the ball off of him. Trying to keep it in the spots where you can't just like full commit to a challenge, then we got a good flick. I'm gonna fake jump here. Make a panic. Should have this. Keep it close enough where I still have control of the play. You can't really do much here, and if, you, if he chooses to full commit to that, it's gonna be pretty bad for him. That was a really good challenge for him. It's gonna be a goal. Good job. A lot of like super close quarters challenges going on there those situations you have to play patient in like every challenge situation like you have to make sure you're not going for anything that's gonna take longer than like a second to recover off of and i went for one challenge that was bad and it leads to what just happened good patience exactly what i was talking about just defend well and i get a free goal and he's a good player so is a very good player He's still around like the semi-pro pro level for sure. So 
This is someone that knows how to do stuff with the ball. They know how to be mechanical. And it applies. Plays a lot of ones as well, so. Tough matchup. Ah, I messed up. I didn't think I didn't think you had boost to get a get enough flick on that, but it was hard. Honestly, kickoff is still the biggest thing in ones. If you can get control out of the kickoff, you already have a, a massive advantage. His last two kickoffs have been really good for him. Try to just stay on it to be annoying. It's fine if I get killed, honestly. Good patience on that. I know I had the advantage pretty hard there still. Try to bump him back wall. Take the mid boost from him and that'd be pretty huge. Let's stay on this now. He doesn't know I have boost, I think, so. Good turn on this. Take another shot. Take another shot. There we go. Yeah, he didn't know I had boost to make a play off of it, so. Figured I should surprise him. Go for a, a quick turn on the shot. It's going to make him have to panic. I know he's below boost, so his save's going to be bad every single time there. Playing for the boost instead of the instant goal. Maybe put to get some pressure off the bat here. I'm going to fake. So let's control this. I don't think he got that back boost, so he didn't. So he's still low boost. So we're trying to make him flick here. Should be able to get the corner, but he's gonna get mid, but I have control of the ball, which is more important, I think. Whoa, what a challenge. It's gonna be a goal. Really good bounce for him, too. That was a very, very like risky challenge for him, I'm not gonna lie. I like stopped focusing for a half second, so like, I didn't see him go up the wall. I honestly didn't think he would. A very risky challenge. Could have very well got him scored on. But it worked out in his favor. Try to save my flip the whole time. I still had my flip, I just didn't want to use it. Because I feel like anything I flipped into there would have gotten me scored on. So. Choosing my battles. In the area. It's more about threatening that you have a play than actually making the play every time, I think, in ones. Even in threes, it's kind of the same idea. I'm going to try to fake this. Probably going to read it, but... So I just gotta defend this well. Look for the boost. Go for the mid boost. I'll go for a ceiling shot maybe. Like here we have control in this whole situation. So I don't have to shoot right away. I can fake a lot of different options. Not like going for ceiling shots. And the ones I think it's really valuable. For that reason. Oh, we just gave up. Alright. Played really well though, honestly. It's good stuff. Good games today. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have yourself a wonderful day or night, whatever time it is. You guys are watching this, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys all in the next one. I love y'all. That's game four to ten played in one. So play some more in the future videos. Peace.